Good evening, everyone. I'm Isaiah Showell, and this is Victory News 2020. Our lead story tonight, the 20-year anniversary of Victory in Christ Christian Center. The year was 2000, when Bishop John and Pastor Aisha held the first meeting with 11 founders and spoke the mission and vision of Victory into existence. Remember 2000, also known as Y2K? Before the calendar turned January 1, many feared that the Y2K computer virus might wipe out power grids, disrupt airline lights, and cause ATM machine malfunctions. The U.S. government set up $50 million in Y2K command centers. The government should have consulted Bishop John and Pastor Aisha because they were able to successfully start and operate Victory on a much smaller budget. Holding its first service on November 19, 2000 at the Marriott Courtyard in Mount Laurel with 59 people in attendance, Victory quickly outgrew the Marriott Courtyard in only six months. And like the boy band NSYNC, that hit, bye bye bye. They moved from Sunday morning and Wednesday evening services to the Radisson Hotel, also in Mount Laurel. Then there's 2001, as NASA launches the Genesis space probe into orbit to collect more accurate information about the composition of the sun. Victory was launched 1450 Clements Bridge Road in Deptford Township to collect souls for the kingdom, the kingdom of God, as they spread more accurate information about the sun. Technology in 2005 saw Microsoft release the Xbox 360 gaming console, yet the excitement of this release could not compare to the elation that filled the congregation as Victory in Christ Christian Center celebrated five years on November 20th, 2005. Did you know that the traditional gift for a five-year anniversary is wood? Why? Because wood is durable, long-lasting, and represents strength. These are the foundations necessary for building strong marriages, and no church spends more time investing in marriages, encouraging couples to keep dating one another, and experience victory in their vows, like Victory in Christ Christian Center. Over the years, Victory has purposely and strategically hosted Valentine's Day sweetheart balls, marriage conferences, destination retreats, and groundbreaking marriage Mondays, hosted by yours truly, Bishop John and Pastor Aisha. Tin and aluminum make the perfect 10-year traditional anniversary gift. It's the flexibility and adaptability of these materials that are also vital for a successful marriage. However, durability, flexibility, and adaptability are not only keys to a successful marriage, but also necessary ingredients for a groundbreaking ministry, like Victory. Speaking of groundbreaking, Victory gathered on September 3rd, 2012 to break ground on new property, 1055 Delcy Drive in Westville, New Jersey. Victory serving partners, families, and friends rejoiced and sang for the grand opening of Victory in Christ Christian Center's new location, June 16, 2013. The year was 2015, and as Common and John Legend picked up an Academy Award for their inspirational song, Glory, from the movie Selma, Victory hosted its very own Oscar-themed night to celebrate a 15-year anniversary. The festivities were held at the mansion in Voorhees, New Jersey, and it was truly a memorable black tie event, complete with red carpet interviews, spotlights that could be seen from miles away, and the paparazzi. The evening was even made even more special as Bishop John and Pastor Aisha celebrated this milestone by giving glory to God and honoring serving partners for their faithfulness to the mission and vision of victory. As extraordinary as that night was, nothing prepared victory for the majestic celebration, affirmation, and elevation of Bishop John's confirmation service on August 18th, 2017. It was a night to remember, from the praise and worship to the presentation of the witness documents. Most notable was the presentation of appointments and the explanation of the symbols of the crest, an unforgettable, wonderful service of witnessing the office of bishopric, bishop, bishop, well, Bishop John became a bishop that day, y'all, and it was momentous. There are so many milestones and historical achievements that have taken place at Victory over the past 20 years. So many people saved, healed, delivered, and liberated to walk in their purpose and their calling. From the installation of our first elders and ministers, the Bible Training Center, installation of deacons, the opening of the Victory House, the establishment of victorious business professionals, and the establishment of Stephen's ministry, I can't possibly tell you in one night. What I can say, as Victory in Christ Christian Center has fulfilled and continues to fulfill its mission and vision rooted in Ephesians chapter 4, verse 12 and 13, to equip God's people to do His work and build up the church and body of Christ until we come to such unity in our faith and knowledge of God's Son that we will be mature and full-grown in the Lord, measuring up to the full stature of Christ. A vision rooted and established in evangelism, discipleship, and leadership. I'm Isaiah Showell saying happy 20th anniversary, Victory. Greater things are yet to come. This is Victory 2020. Good night and good news.